Where am I today? Uh oh. Got the Manhattan skyline right there. Beautiful, huh? Right on the water. Ah, beautiful New York, right? That the Statue of Liberty is right there. Right there. That's the Statue of Liberty. Where am I today? That's not a guitar, it's a kite. Oh, damn. Check this shit out. You're going to love this, man. Fucking. It's the only time kids are bearable. You can never put this many kids in one pile without killing each other or killing you. Except there's something interesting to do. Kites. Hi. Oh, damn. It's the Brooklyn Bridge Kite Festival. Now, the wind is a little low today. So there's a lot of grounded kites right now. We'll wait for the wind to pick up. We'll check it out. Ah, oh, kids are busy. They're busy assembling their kites. Oh, I got my kite with me, but I flew for about 10 minutes. I almost got crushed. <laughs> Oh, the kite festival. Some days, you know, it's just, it's, this is the story, right? Life can be good, right? We're out on a pier, right? We're literally, this is Brooklyn, Brooklyn side of the Brooklyn Bridge. Right? In fact, right up there is the uh, Brooklyn Promenade. You've seen that in a lot of Woody Allen movies. Right? So, there's a walking promenade, very wealthy waterfront properties. We're literally on a pier right now. <laughs> Low winds, a lot of frustration in the air. <laughs> I brought too big a kite today. So, some nice kites up there. Big purple guy, big purple monster. <laughs> the wind is about three miles to five miles an hour. It's a little, little light. It causes people to run into each other. <laughs> When the wind is strong, you shouldn't you shouldn't be running anywhere. Right? It's like surfing, right? When the surf is up, man, the waves just just drop into that wave. Flying kites are similar. You gotta wait for the wind to be right. You turn your back to it, and pow, up you go. Kite Festival in Brooklyn. <laughs> I'm telling you, this is—it's almost an impossibility to put this many kids in one on one pier without screaming and crying and carrying on. They're having a good time, right? What does that tell you? Put a kite in a kid's hand. They're loving it. Ooh, this guy's got a big kite right here. Big kite. Go talk to that guy with the big kite.
How's it going today? Tough wind, right? There's the pilot. He's ignoring me. He's <laughs> busy with his kite. Ah, oh, there we go. There's a whole sky full of kites. You see that movie, The Kite Runner? Kite Runner, remember that? The Kite Runner was... I think it was like, uh, Afghanistan or maybe Pakistan. It was set in Pakistan where a kid was... Uh, a kid and his friends, they were... That all they wanted to do was fly kites, but the kite runner was the guy <clears throat> when someone's kite got cut. Like it's this competition. There's no competition here, this is just for fun. When when you're up in the sky and it, and it's too crowded and you want to cut somebody's kite down, right? You could do that, right? That's fair game. Hey, this is my airspace. And I'm going to cut you down. Right? And then, when you cut somebody down, the guy who runs for the kite is the kite runner. Because once that kite is cut, once someone cuts your kite, that kite is no longer yours. That kite becomes common property. Right? All right. What is the moral of the story? What do you got to prove flying a kite? <laughs> What's the political ramification of your kite? <clears throat> is that a political kite? Dogs are not liking kite. Can I check you, dog? Hello, dog. You enjoying the kite day? Enjoying the kite show? Ah, people are uptight. The adults are uptight and the kids are having a good time. Isn't that always the way? Ah, to be a kid again, right? Got 75, 80 years before you? Right? They don't know what they're getting themselves into, huh? <laughs> Shit is crazy, right? The world is falling apart. <laughs> Corruption. <laughs> Epic. Amateur kite flyers, right? They're frustrated because the, because their kite won't stay up. But there's a reason for that. You know the surfers, right? There's a thing about surfing, right? Even world-class surfers, they never jump right in the water, right? You'll see the waves busting, big waves, right? But they sit on the beach and they wait. They wait for that right moment. Right? And it's dangerous, too. Flying kites aren't dangerous. Well, the worst that can happen is you lose your kite. You wait for that moment. You wait for your opening. I tried and it was like, oh, no, no. I have a double line kite, two line. I could cut everybody down in a heartbeat, but <laughs> it's a little too aggressive. It's like, uh, I think it's, I think my kite is like six feet. Six feet wide. 
I haven't flown in a while. Does it get much nicer in New York than this right here? 70 degrees. Beautiful 70 degree weather. Seventies. This is actually an old pier. You know? It's an old pier. Who knows what was before? Maybe big boats? I don't know. Maybe army boats. That's the thing I love the most about New York. It really is a multiracial place. Right. You got like your f five different brands of Asian. <laughs> you got your Koreans. You got your you got your Chinese. Three three dialects of Chinese. You got your Japanese. Southeast Asians. You got the Thais. You know, Thais kicking in. And um, <laughs> or do you want to go to I don't know what I'm talking about. All kinds of people is what I'm trying to say, you know. Kids don't know the difference. Right? You learn by watching the kids, right? Watch their behavior. You watch the way they are unaffected, you know, natural. But again, that's only when they're, when they're enjoying themselves, when there's something to do. There's a, there's a kind of, some kind of kite table. Some kind of instructional instructional kite table. Ah, uh, Marcus County reporting. Beautiful New York skyline. Reporting from the Kite Show. 2019 Kite Festival, New York City. Woo! It's like something, something, something important is going on over there. There's people building their kites. Ah oh, well. I hope you enjoyed that. Break from the politics, huh? God damn. Too much politics. Yeah. How many times can you say Robin Mueller? <laughs> How many times can you say Crooked Hillary? <laughs> you give that shit a break. Make your head explode. <laughs> Enjoy the simple... The simple qualities of life. Flying a kite. Oh, I feel some wind. I feel it building up the wind. I feel the wind building up. Marcus County reporting from the Kite Festival in Brooklyn, New York. <laughs> 